More officials are being shown the exit from government. The latest is the head of the Pasig River Rehabilitation Commission. President Rodrigo Duterte stressed that there will be no let up in his government's fight against corruption. More details from Daniel Manelastas. President Rodrigo Duterte has led the awarding ceremony for the outstanding government workers for 2019. During his speech, the president expressed the need to stop the corruption in the government as it continues to damage the country. And because of this, the president has made a move as he asked Pasig River Rehabilitation Commission Executive Director Jose Antonio Goicha. The president couldn't help but express dismay over the sacked government official. President Duterte also revealed during an interview that he fired Goicha due to his claim that he will be appointed to the Bureau of Customs. He is also looking into other members of the commission due to alleged corruption. Inuna ko ito because uh, it's been brooding about the siya ang ilagay ko sa customs at nag 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 ano na nag hingi na ng mga pera doon sa mga those who are connected with uh, sa customs. Malacañang has confirmed that it's part of the government's anti-corruption drive. Presidential spokesperson Salvador Panelo advised Goicha to turn over his documents to the office of the Deputy Executive Director for Finance and Administrative Services. He also reminded that may this be an example and proof that the government will be stern in eradicating corruption. Aside from Goicha, the president also announced that he will fire another government official but he refused to reveal the name yet. May isa pa akong tanggalin, though she is not corrupt but... Uh... She is not in parity with the other's uh, performance. Handling an economic uh, office, I have to change him. In line with his fight against corruption, President Duterte also wants the removal of a customs broker. As he said, that also a source of anomalous acts. Sabihin mo sa Pilipino, kung gusto talaga nila walang corruption, tanggalin na natin yan mga ano, Gross, wala ng examiner, sa customs, wala ng brokers. Ang kumpanya ng pada may accreditation lang sila. Sila na mismo ang magtrabaho doon. Take away the brokers and you would have cut corruption overnight. Daniel Manalastas for the nation. Beyond the headlines, it's news with a different perspective before the day ends. For events that shape our views and impacts the world around us. We keep you up to speed. With Richmond Cruise and Charms Espina. PTV News Headlines. Your comprehensive nightly news source. Only here.